U.S. stocks ended Monday little changed after suffering steep losses earlier in the trading session. Investors reacted to the jobs report out Friday when markets were closed for Good Friday and prepared for a busy week of data and bank earnings. The Dow Industrials rose three-tenths of one percent, the S&P 500 gained one-tenth, and the Nasdaq fell less than a tenth. The jobs report showed robust payrolls growth and a welcome but modest wage inflation cooldown. While it signaled the Federal Reserve's restrictive policies beginning to have its intended economic dampening effect, it raised the odds that the central bank will move forward with another quarter-point increase to the Fed Fund's target rate at its May policy meeting. Data later this week on consumer and producer prices will shed light on the status of inflation, while Friday brings earnings from several big banks, including Wells Fargo. Winthrop Capital Markets Chief Portfolio Manager Adam Coons likes the stock. Uh, so on the equity side, uh, one thing that we're looking at are banks. Uh, they've obviously traded off uh, quite sharply, uh, so we are seeing some values in regional banks uh, and what we would call the more supranational uh, regional banks. So things like uh, Wells Fargo, uh, Huntington, um, and uh, PNC. Uh, we think that those have oversold. We think that their balance sheets are, are, are firm. Uh, we think that they have good assets um, and their asset liability matching uh, is on point. So we think that those are banks that are just fine, just kind of uh, names that have been thrown out with, you know, baby with a bathwater type mentalities. Stocks making moves Monday included shale oil producer Pioneer Natural Resources which climbed 6% following a report that ExxonMobil held preliminary talks with the company about a potential acquisition. Also, Charles Schwab, which added 5% after reporting its second highest ever influx of client assets in March.